Hi, I'm glad you stopped by the garden. Today is Thursday, January 13th. We're going to do lesson 10, water. Y'all remember being a kid and drinking out of the water hose? We never thought a thing about it. I don't think it hurt us much. I've lived a very long time, and I drank a lot of water out of a lot of garden hoses. In a winter garden or a cold frame setup, the colder the air is, the more evaporation we get. So it's very important to make sure your plants are good and watered. Yes, Captain Obvious, we know. We got to water the garden. <laughs> I know this sounds very simplistic. I actually have a point to this. I've had several questions about why we have buckets all over the garden. I'll get to that in just a second. This series is about the soil food web. So what does water actually have to do with the soil food web? Remember what makes up the soil food web? Bacteria, fungus, protozoa, and the like. So what do municipalities put in their water system to keep us safe? Chlorine, chloramine, what kills bacteria? Chlorine, chloramine, and other chemicals. To have a healthy soil food web, you really need to be careful of what kind of water you put on your garden. You don't have to go buy Perrier. By just filling a bucket with your hose and letting it sit in the sun for a while, allows that chlorine and chloramine to disperse some. And that makes it a lot healthier for the life in your soil. Then you can pour it into a watering pitcher like I was just doing, and you're pretty safe. Of course, regular rainwater is going to be the best for the garden. If you can have a rain barrel set up, that's great. Well water would be your next choice. If you don't have either one of those and you just have municipal water, city water, put it in a bucket. Let it sit in the garden. That's why we have all the buckets out here all summer long. Now one of the benefits of having a no-till garden, all that microbial life holds a lot of water, so you really don't have to water a whole lot. That is the other benefit of a no-till garden. That tastes great. In the soil food web, it does matter. I apologize, this does seem very basic. All of this information is just to help us become better gardeners. You can do this too. The more I find out, the better the results I get. I just wanted to share that with you, but I never gave it a thought that the water I was using could be hurting my garden. You can do this too. And I do want to thank you for stopping by the garden for a chat. Remember, till next time, take care of yourself, take care of your family, and God bless you. Come on, let's plant. Let's go plant garden.